Hello Nathan and the rest of the founder team. My name is Sanachi Agina and I'm currently in Bellflower, California. By the time you get this video, I should be in New York City. What you're about to see is a compilation of who I am as a person all around. And when you're ready to talk, my information is at the end of the clip. I think you should pick me because it's a no-brainer. <laughs> I'm so excited, eh. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Jay Bound, they come get it. I'm so excited. Uh, I'm so excited. Do you know the odds of becoming a human being? They're 400 trillion to one. You're more likely to win the lotto 10 times in your life than have an actual life. Gary Vaynerchuk told me that. After some time, I decided I needed to change. So I have not been online for a while. I've been going through a lot of transitions. The biggest one is that I moved to New York City. Yes, I've moved to New York. It's going to be a three months and I've just been adjusting. I'm still thrifting. I'm still doing what I can where I am and just feel like a lot of changes are happening. Also, it's kind of pricey to live here, but we're making do with what we got. And I'm so thankful for my friends because I would not be here without them, literally. Wow, thank you, thank you. But yeah, if you want to fund your girl, go fund me. I'm just kidding. But seriously, buy my clothes. And uh, yeah, you'll help a sister out a lot. Buy my clothes. My Depop is waking up dressed. I decided to take the biggest risk of my life and move to New York City with no job lined up. Luckily, I had a friend that would house me, but I was literally going to have to hustle and make something happen out of nothing. All I could hear was Gary's advice, take the risk. In a sense, I was part of the target audience, that young and aspiring entrepreneur who wanted to see if they could risk it all and make it on their own terms. I'm currently in New Jersey. I'm looking for Gerard Adams and his business founders. I went to the location on the website and it's not that location. I got a free ride from a couple that helped me out. So I'm super happy. At first I was kind of scared. I was like, no, I don't want to get in the car. But then I was like, yeah, I kind of do. These are not my cats, but they're so cute. With all good things, one must be patient while learning how to develop and come into a new environment. So I explored my area, I met people, I networked, I put myself in different situations and I didn't stay in my room. I wanted to make sure that I was taking in this new city, my new home, New York. CJ Balvin in concert and I am so excited! We live in a world today where anyone can become anything because most people own a cellular device and honestly you can create an empire from your bedroom. In this world information is everything. Being able to connect to the right people during the right time that is what allows us to grow and broaden our reach. So I am at the Oculus. It looks like this. And um, I just picked up my schedule because I don't work here, but I work close. Small wins became big wins for me. Got the job and I kept it moving. Good morning. Um, I'm wearing red lipstick. I'm my environment was shaping my behaviors. I could tell that who and what I believed about myself was changing. I could tell that there was no limit. If I wanted it, I just had to make a plan and go get it. I'm super excited for what could happen today while the student, the audience taping and everything for Jimmy Kimmel. But I'm also super excited for this Saturday Barclay Center. 
I'm so excited. The day has arrived. Today is October 20th, 2018. <laughs> But every entrepreneur who's building something special encounters moments of defeat. It's not how you fall or how many times you fall, no, but if you have the courage to get back up. So it's just like, I need to save money. I cannot be spending money out here like this. Especially for the next seven weeks. I have seven weeks, so I can do this. But I'm super excited. Yes. People like that. Eric Thomas once said, the most important thing is to be able at any moment to sacrifice what you are for what you will become. And I was becoming. I am back. So November has been a very high spending month. Have a good day. Merry Christmas. Bye. Well, I've been reading a lot of books like Think and Grow Rich. Oh, you read the new ones, don't you? <laughs> And bright ideas, so multi-million. I'm trying to be. A, I want to be a. They publish. I want to be like a billionaire from Fresno, like. <laughs> a billionaire. I mean, why not? You know, I'm gonna say this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. One, two, three. Never, okay, great. So, ooh, yeah. It sounds like Korean barbecue, like Brogogi. <laughs> Go, what's going on, guys? That your hair is a shammer. <laughs> opportunity to interview for you uh, to become your next show host, journalist, and interviewer for the podcast. Entrepreneurship is something that I think can unlock the door to the rest of the world for a lot of people. I know I'm a little more business minded. I think business has a lot of tools to create and solve problems. Not create problems, solve problems but really dig deep and understand what is going on. And this would be a great opportunity to learn, to talk to a lot of industry leaders and share this information to average everyday people who are just trying to change their life for the better. 